Welcome back to Nadia's Life for Real. I hope you guys are staying safe. Thank you guys for coming back to check out the channel. If you're new, welcome. If you are a faithful Nadia Nation viewer, thank you all so much for your support. We appreciate that over here, okay? So I went ahead and I bought a few things from Amazon. And I also, at the end of the video, I was cooking yesterday and I decided to just film it so you guys can see just a little part of my, my life. So there's a cook with me at the end of the video. And what I made was shrimp fried rice. I did it with regular, steam, regular white rice and I also substituted with cauliflower rice because my husband doesn't eat white rice, okay? So let me start the haul. I got a care kit, a candle care kit from Amazon. This, the brand is called Sweetwater Decor Candle Care Kit. In the kit, it came with the wick trimmer, which is this, and I got it in gold, okay? It also came with the bell snuffer, which is this beauty right here. And on the end, it has engraved the brand. It's really pretty. And then this right here is the wig. I think this is the wig dipper. Yes. So, of course, I tested that last night. This is really cool. You know, sometimes after you finish burning your candle, the wax is kind of just one side is high, one side is low. This right here, when it's still soft, you can just go ahead and scrape the edges and it just fall inside. And then that gives you more burn time when you're gonna, when you're gonna um, light it again tomorrow. As a candle lover and a candle person, this is gonna come in handy and I can't wait to go ahead and have it styled somewhere. And I think I'm gonna get a few more because I just wanna get a few more and be fancy. Okay, next I got some pillow covers. Now, I don't love these pillow covers. I like them. Well, I love one in particular, but there's an issue. So let me get into it. So it's, they're beautiful. Honestly, they are, I think for me, it's the fabric that kind of got me turned off a little bit. And they are, it says 100% cotton. Just not like the feel of it. So this is the print. So this is one, it's black and white. That's one. Um, this is another one. This is really pretty. Black. This one. So in the entire pack came four. And this one. Now, with this one, look. The zipper is not, doesn't work. So I went ahead and requested that they sent me another one. And I decided to keep these because my son in the in, in the room I'm going to use it. My son um don't care for pillars. So I don't want to spend a lot of money on it. And he loves the prints, so I'm going to work with them as much as possible. I might just change the insert. Because right now it has, it has a feather, right now it has a feather fill insert. And um, I don't know. So comment below and tell me if you guys like it or should I return them all. Hmm. But together they look good though. And it was like maybe $40. So I don't know. I don't know. That that is why I'm not a big online shopper because I like to buy stuff in the store where I can feel it and just and from there I can just I can, I can make a decision. But I don't know. I don't know. The next thing I got from Amazon was oh another pillow. But this this I love. I was looking for um Euro shams because I have a lot of Euro pillows, a lot of insert. And I saw DIY with KB. She mentioned, I don't know if it's this particular brand, but she said Amazon sells these beautiful um, shams that has a kind of hotel um, look to it. And I do like it. So, but in this case, it only came with one pillowcase and I'm going to order another one. So, can you see it? But it's really pretty though. I honestly like this, so I'm going to get more. The next thing I got was this. Remember I told you guys... Um, JB and I in the process of just restyling and just elevate our master. We constantly argue over charger. We both have iPhones and we both have um, Apple Watches. So we're constantly like, who has a charger? Who has a charger? And it's starting to be annoying. So I went on Amazon and I found this right here. It's a three-in-one charger. You can charge your watch, you can charge your earpods, and you can charge your phone. This is what it looks like. So this is what it looks like. You can put your phone right here. You put your watch over here and you can raise it up. Hold up. 
so you can raise it up right here and then back here you have somewhere for your earpods and the fun thing with this you can turn your phone anyway whether it be this way or this way and that'd be good plug it in and it stays right there so it's like a charging station that works well with her with our lifestyle pretty much that's what it is but again it wasn't, it wasn't i'm a... gonna go ahead and set these things up and show you how it looked and then the next few seconds you're gonna see the cook with me so hang on <laughs> I spray, give you all what your life is. I know what I say. Give me baby girl another night. When you want something, come on, you can ask and I never say no. You know what I say? Upgrade and nice, I can get you some. I met a girl from the UK. She a damn she a cute. I tell her come if she want. Now we're into the cooking portion. So I'm getting just getting prep. I'm cutting up all up all the peppers right here. I love using these orange and yellow and red peppers. I think it just brings some vibrancy to my shrimp fried rice. So it's all cut up. Next, I'm going to season the shrimp. And my, speci my special um spice trick is to add some jerk sauce to this. You're going to see that later on. So now I'm just using a, a regular black pepper, um, garlic powder, and salt. And I think I used a mixed spice that I got from Costco. All my seasons I buy from bulk from Costco. Okay, guys, if you decide to try this recipe and use jerk sauce, please be mindful that it is spicy, even though they also sell jerk season, which is also mild and spice. But mine is very spicy because that's what I like. I wanna see you, see you have. Quick question Am I the only person who rinsed their rice? Um, growing up in the islands, we were raised to rinse our rice at least until the water is clear on top. So that's what I'm doing right here. And um, yeah, so comment below and let me know if you guys do that as well. With this first set of shrimp in here, we let the shrimp hard. So I'm going to let it steam a little bit longer and then we're going to add the rest to it. So I'm waiting for the shrimp to finish. The rice is almost done. Um, and I put four, I put, I put, I put four people over my rice once it's dried out. So that's just something that my mom just taught me from the islands to do. And I've been doing it. Once everything is, um, is done, then I'm going to saute all this together. Um, my husband doesn't eat rice. So I do have, I do have cauliflower rice for him, which I'm going to do. And then once all this is done, I'm going to do the eggs and then everything's gonna be combined, okay? So, hope you guys are enjoying this cook with me. And we like our shrimp hard, okay? So, we like to overcook the shrimp because that's how we like it. But however you like it, cook it that way. But it's, it's, it's really simple though. And the next thing I put in here is, um, I do sweet corn. And the reason why I like to make my, make my own um, fried rice is because I know what I like in my fried rice. And because I know what I like, that's what I put in it, okay? But if you want to put other vegetables in it, like mushroom or whatever, you know, beans, peas, whatever, do it. It's customized to your own tasting because this right here is definitely to how we like it. Spicy, easy. I'm going to go ahead and put this in the microwave just to get it thawed out a little bit. We had that jerk sauce, right? I like that. So comment below and tell me um, if you got what, 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 um, what would you do different with this entire seasoned rice process? Not seasoned rice, I'm sorry. Shrimp fried rice process here. Season that as well. 
I'm just coming the eggs. So everything is cooked, the rice is cooked, the shrimp is cooked, the veggies is cooked, and I'm doing the eggs. So now it's time for me to I'm gonna do my husband's first, the cauliflower first. I'm gonna put like a little bit of oil in here, just a little bit. And I'm not a neat cook because as I cook, I just put all the mess on one side, and then when I'm done, I clean up. Okay, so I'm on the cauliflower to get heated up a little bit, like thoroughly. So I just spread it out in a pan to show you. See, just spread it out like that. Um, of course. A little bit of garlic powder. A little bit of black pepper. I'm not going to have no additional spice because my husband doesn't like spicy food. All right, so I'm almost done. I hope you guys are following along. I'm not a chef. This is how I cook. I don't use special measurement. And if I didn't mention earlier, then I have to add soy sauce to kind of get that dark coloring. I just show you guys. Take everything we got, give it an honest shot, turning it on and off. We've been sliding, riding the highest dream. So right about now, I'm getting ready to just make my husband's um portion of the of the meal so that's why i'm separating some of the seasoning and the spices from that plate i'm about to add the shrimp that's the last thing i add and then also add the egg and then a quick stir with everything like that and then voila it's done it's very simple The rice, the only difference is from the cauliflower to the rat rice, and then you're gonna see the plating. Now I'm making mine with the rice. The only difference that I'm doing, I'm gonna I'm gonna add some red pepper flakes to mine because I like it spicy. That's all, but just combine all the ingredients together, the rice and everything, and enjoy. Alrighty guys, so that's it. Thank y'all so much for watching. I hope you 
guys try the recipe i'm going to just link it below again i'm not a chef it's just the season is just season accordingly to your taste okay um thank you so much for your support thank you thank you thank you uh if you'd like to see more cook with me or even more amazon haul on my channel let me know below that's the only way i can know what you guys enjoy if you tell me below in the comment section let's have fun the conversation if you do try the recipe please let me know what if you do if you use the exact same thing or you tweak it if you did if you took the shrimp part or just put chicken or just do all vegetable let me know um i hope you guys enjoy thank you thank you thank you so much i'm really excited today for some reason but you guys be safe i hope you guys if you guys are going to try let me know if you're going to try any of these amazon products that i, that I make ref um that i refer to all those things are going to be below don't forget to comment and subscribe. Stay safe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.